Welcome to Gigantic Supplementos, the channel that aims to bring valuable information about health, nutrition, and supplementation. Today, we will address a crucial and often overlooked topic, the safety of creatine use in the elderly. Creatine is widely known for its benefits in athletic performance, but is it safe for the elderly population? Follow this video closely as we explore every detail related to this question, providing essential information for our viewers to make informed decisions about using this supplement. Understanding how creatine can impact the health of the elderly is vital, and here at Gigantic Supplementos, we are committed to providing well-founded clarifications. Creatine is a natural compound present in the human body and found in foods like red meat and fish. However, natural production may decrease with age, leading to questions about supplementation in the elderly. Scientific studies have consistently demonstrated the benefits of creatine in various aspects of health, such as improvement in cognitive and muscular function, but the question of safety in the elderly persists. The elderly population often faces specific health challenges, such as loss of muscle mass and reduced strength, areas where creatine can play a significant role. Understanding potential side effects and medication interactions is crucial when considering creatine supplementation in the elderly. Consulting with a healthcare professional is fundamental in this process. Let's analyze recent studies addressing the safety of creatine in the elderly, examining their results and conclusions to offer a comprehensive view on the subject. In addition to physical aspects, creatine may also have positive implications for the mental health of the elderly, something we will explore in more detail throughout the video. The individuality of each person must be taken into consideration when deciding on supplementation. Some elderly individuals may benefit significantly, while others may need additional precautions. Monitoring creatine levels in the body, whether through tests or observable signs, is an integral part of safety monitoring for the supplement in the elderly. Despite the potential benefits, we will highlight the importance of a balanced approach, emphasizing that creatine is not a one-size-fits-all solution but rather a component of a healthy lifestyle. We will conclude with a synthesis of the presented information, reinforcing the importance of a careful and informed approach when considering creatine as a supplement for the elderly population. Creatine, a natural compound primarily found in meat and fish, has been the subject of study across various age groups, but the question of its safety for the elderly is of particular importance. Our bodies produce creatine, however, this production tends to decrease with aging, raising questions about supplementation in this population. Scientific research has consistently highlighted the benefits of creatine, ranging from improvements in physical performance to cognitive gains. However, the applicability of these results to the elderly still needs to be fully understood. Can creatine offer similar benefits in terms of strength and cognitive function for older individuals? As individuals age, many face the loss of muscle mass and decreased strength, conditions that can significantly impact quality of life. Studies suggest that creatine may have positive effects in these areas, acting as a potential ally in the fight against sarcopenia, age-related muscle loss. Still, when considering the safety of creatine for the elderly, it is essential to address potential side effects. Mild gastrointestinal issues, though rare, have been reported in some cases. Additionally, creatine may interact with certain medications, requiring a cautious approach. Examining recent studies specifically dedicated to the safety of creatine in the elderly allows us to analyze more up-to-date data. The interpretation of these results contributes to our understanding of the risks and benefits associated with using this supplement in an older population. Individuality plays a crucial role in this discussion. Each person is unique in their physical constitution and specific needs. Some older individuals may respond positively to creatine supplementation, experiencing notable benefits while others may need additional precautions due to pre-existing health conditions. Beyond physical aspects, there is also the consideration of mental health. Creatine has been associated with improvements in brain function and may play a role in preventing or reducing age-related cognitive decline. This additional dimension of potential benefits highlights the complexity of the relationship between creatine and aging. Monitoring creatine levels in the body is a relevant practice when assessing the safety of the supplement in the elderly. Regular tests and observation of any signs of discomfort are important preventive measures to ensure a positive supplementation experience. Despite potential benefits, it is crucial to emphasize that creatine is not a one-size-fits-all solution. It should be considered as part of a comprehensive regimen that includes a balanced diet and healthy lifestyle habits. Balance and moderation are fundamental principles when integrating creatine into the routine of the elderly, avoiding extremes that may compromise health. 
In summary, the question of the safety of creatine for the elderly is multifaceted. The analysis of recent scientific evidence provides an enlightening perspective on the benefits and potential risks associated with this supplementation in a population facing specific age-related challenges. Creatine can be a useful supplement for the elderly as it helps increase strength and muscle mass. It works by enhancing the availability of phosphocreatin in the muscle, which is an immediate source of energy for intense muscle contractions. Studies show that creatine supplementation in the elderly can significantly increase muscle strength, anaerobic performance, and muscle mass. This is crucial for maintaining functionality and preventing age-related loss of muscle mass and strength. Creatine can help seniors have more energy and capacity to perform daily activities more easily, such as climbing stairs, shopping, walking longer distances, etc. This improves the quality of life by allowing more independence and mobility. In addition to the physical benefits, studies indicate that creatine can also have positive effects on cognitive function in the elderly, possibly due to its ability to improve energy metabolism in the brain. This can help maintain brain health as individuals age. The recommended daily dose of creatine for seniors is approximately 3 to 5 grams. This amount seems to be sufficient to provide the benefits described by various studies without significant side effects. Creatine is considered safe at these doses. Oral supplementation in the form of powder or capsules is the most practical and effective way to consume creatine. Cycling creatine is not necessary. It can be taken daily for extended periods to maintain increased levels in the muscle. Creatine is well tolerated by the majority of seniors. Side effects are rare, but may include mild gastrointestinal discomfort or weight gain due to water retention. Overall, these effects are minimized with adequate fluid intake. Creatine can be a good option for seniors looking to preserve muscle strength and functionality, maintain independence, and improve physical performance. When combined with resistance exercises, it further enhances gains in muscle mass and strength. Given its favorable safety profile and numerous benefits documented by research, creatine is now a popular supplement among active seniors aiming to enhance their physical and mental capacity. Its use can make a significant difference in health as individuals age. Exploring the positive aspects of creatine for seniors, we highlight a series of benefits that can positively influence the quality of life in this population. Studies indicate that creatine can play a crucial role in preserving muscle mass, aiding in the fight against sarcopenia, common in aging. Additionally, it is observed that creatine supplementation can contribute to improved muscle strength, promoting greater functional independence for seniors in their daily activities. Another positive aspect is the potential influence of creatine on cognitive function. Research suggests that this supplement can have beneficial effects on the brain, being associated with improvements in memory and concentration. These aspects are crucial for the overall well-being and autonomy of seniors. The safety of creatine is emphasized by the absence of serious side effects in most cases. Occurrences of gastrointestinal discomfort are mostly mild and temporary. The low incidence of adverse effects contributes to the positive consideration of creatine as a safe supplement for seniors. It's important to note that creatine can be easily incorporated into the dietary routine, being an accessible and practical option for those seeking to maintain or improve their physical and mental health in advanced age. The simplicity of its use adds a positive aspect when considering the inclusion of this supplement in the lives of seniors. Given the benefits and safety associated with the use of creatine in seniors, we can conclude that this supplement can play a valuable role in promoting health and well-being in this stage of life. Positive aspects include the preservation of muscle mass, increased muscle strength, and potential cognitive benefits, contributing to a holistic approach to senior health. We encourage our viewers to consider including creatine in their supplementation routines, always taking into account their individual needs and consulting healthcare professionals if necessary. At Gigantic Supplementos, we seek to provide useful and informed information so that you can make informed decisions about your health and well-being.